that. That's good enough. That big one's going to make a sprocket. That would have been much more. I think it doesn't really. What, this? Yeah, I don't know. We want to be able to push it on nice and square, yeah. don't we? Once the rubbish, we'll have a look at the starting so, yeah. Right, so this is how far we've got. This is obviously have to be, that is going to have to be there. So what we're going to do, we're going to bore that out with an interference fit and then we're going to cut this up, put a spigot on this like that, which is going to go into there. So that end of that crank with the flywheel and everything is going to be spigot it into there and then we'll probably weld it round or think of something. And then this one, we're going to cut it off, bore a hole, and that is going to get spigoted onto there, like that. This is an A35 cover, and that one is a mini cover. So obviously we're going to take that off and we're going to put that on there, so that when we finish the engine, we'll be able to put it in the A35. So that's a very useful bit. As you can see, the engine that we've broken up was not exactly beautiful. It, was, it obviously was standing in water. So it was a bit rough, and that's the crank, which is a bit rough. So um, I don't feel guilty about chopping these bits up anyway, because there's millions of them. But, you know, having been involved with classic cars all my life, every time I chop something up, I'm very, you know, I'm very careful, because I think, oh, you know, someday that might be a nice bit that somebody really wants, but I don't think we've got any problems with any of this. And if it's all involved in that, I think that would be something worth having. We'll obviously put it on a nice stand, put a starter motor on it, and we'll, put a duck, we'll, we'll do it all, and we'll start it up on the stand for the video, and then we'll put it in the car, and then the next thing, hopefully by then the weather will be nice, and we can have a drive in a two-cylinder A30, which would be a bit of fun. Funny part is it's going to be in my racing car, which has got lovely wheels, it's got a limited slip diff and a roll case, so <laughs> it's going to look like it's going to go racing with a two-cylinder engine. Oh yeah, yeah, well that's another thing. Yeah. So that's it, look. Yeah. Then what are you going to have to clock up to get the centre for the... Yeah. Oh, to bore this centre. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, luckily I left a bit on, being an expert. <laughs> 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 Be a bit precarious. Yeah, that's come off the thing now. Oh dear. That should do it on a mill, couldn't we? decided the only way we can get a hole in this for the other one to spig it into we couldn't do it on a lathe so we've had to do it on the milling machine so we're now we're now clocking this up to the old big end that we sawn off so that when we drill a hole well no when we bore a hole it's in the dead right place to keep the stroke right and obviously the crankshaft true Don't no. think we'll have to press the world that. No. Let's just press it. Yeah, so what we want is our 
thing on there, don't we? And then press it on there. What do you think? You know, a flat thing. I'm amazed at that. That was more than I thought. Yeah. Seeing as your sizes and everything. Who won it? Yeah, perfect. On the flat, didn't we? Yeah. Looks like he's bending it. Pushing it wonky, isn't it? Yeah. That's the trouble. Oh, I don't think so. I think it squared it up. Oh, is it? Go on. Yeah. Then. Gap one side, so it is a bit wonky. Yeah? Yeah. Where's it gap? This side. Should we give it a bit of a. No. Because we were pushing it on that, weren't we? Yeah. F***ing hot. Let's see. Too foul. I think that is about as near as we're going to get that, you know. On our mini engine, if we're going to have one up and one down, this centre crank is going to have to have a journal like that, but just there. So rather than cut it all up, we can, we're going to mill a hole in there, and we're going to... and put, we're going to press that into there, like that. So that's what we're doing at the moment. But John's trying to clock up the original um, big end journal, and then he will move the milling machine that way, the length of the stroke. So we get that hole there in the dead right place, hopefully. Moved. If we have a, you know, if we've got an odd, um, you know, length of stroke, I think we'll find the standard crank's not that accurate. No, like I say, between them two, I'm sure it's about 10 foul different. Yeah. Yeah,
don't know, it's a good size for size fit. But that is a mini crank. Has it gone down? Well, it's got. Where else has it gone? Well, yeah, that's true. Do you know what I mean? There's none on the it's top. It's not there, about, yeah. is it? No. If that ain't got it, must it will. Yeah, when I feed some in there. No, it's only half a stick though. But then that, you know, half a stick is a lot, isn't it? Oh yeah, when there was no gap. Yeah. It's definitely pulled in. Without a doubt. If you could get that part, that'd be covered. I, I think if that breaks, I should be amazed. Yeah, we might as well stop doing what we're doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Well, when we've done this, what we will do, we will put that between things to see whether it's statically mm. balanced. And if it looks terrible, then we'll probably take it and have it balanced. Yeah. And they just grind lumps off of there, you know? Yeah. And obviously that one there, that's funny, look, we'll have to machine that at yeah. an angle. But we do that. No, that's going to be good. I thought we can have a look at this, because, you know, we've tacked it, haven't we? Yeah, well, I mean, the it's thing is... A million miles out. That one there is the, is the one, isn't it? This one here, yeah. we don't know yet. Nice. Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Did you get that on film? <laughs> It just there's a bit of bell, bell wire. Yeah, down we there. must do that. And old John keeps saying we must do that, but we never do it. Like you know, it's just, it's done to keep us on the ball, really. <laughs> I thought my leg got blown off then. <laughs> <laughs> you never know. After all our videos, we might get the girls lining up with their bikinis on to see if we fancy having them here. We want to come and see you welding. You never know. I I I got hold of a woman once years ago. And, you know, obviously you get to know them, don't you? And I got to know them. She said, do you remember blah, blah, blah? I said, no. What was... She said, you came and sat next to me at this f***ing door or something, she said. And I thought, ooh, I felt all funny. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what, I don't know how I did it, but I'll tell you what, I wish I could f***ing put it in bottles. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah, it's all in the vice and look what it's like inside. What do you think? If we could do it, that is. We try that quick then. Yeah, I think it has come through. Yeah, it looks like it's come through as much yeah. Think it's worth doing it like that. Yeah, that's what I thought, you see. Just put a little bit in, in there, if you know what I mean. Yeah, I think that too. I think that well went. I don't think it's better for them anyway, because when you think how they press them together. What it is, the crank, obviously, doing the Heath Robinson method of reviews is not very exactly accurate. But obviously we're going to get it ground, but we want to get it somewhere near, because obviously the flywheel wants to run through, and when the people grind it, they're going to have a problem if it's too far out. So this is really just a way of straightening it as best we can with the, what we've got available, really. It goes down there, so we want to come back a bit. Right. It's supposed to show, doesn't it? So it's high. Low, yes. So we've got to pull it back a bit, basically. How is the centre plane looking now? Well, that's saying 15, but then you don't know how accurate it is in there, do you? No. Yeah, I think the back one's the important one, isn't it? 
It doesn't get a change when it calls that one. See, that's only 15. Yeah. So high. Low there. High there. Low. So it wants to inferior, wants to go a bit more like yeah. that way, yeah. Yeah. Was that like a thumb? Yeah, well, you know, when you get down to sort of fouls of an inch. <laughs> to achieve that I'm not saying it's beautiful but it's a start because actually doing this we noticed that the centre main was much narrower than the mini one so we had to slim the centre main down but this is not obviously for this crankcase it's just a separate one so what we're going to do we're going to fit the we're going to fit the main bearings and, and probably shuffle that in position and, and not rely on dowels. It's not very true, but we've spoken to the man of grinds crankshafts and he said to us that um, he knows he can get 40 thou undersized bearings and we reckon that if he puts, you know, trues it up from the ends and just grinds it, I think it'll be usable. So we've wedged it as well. We'll put it in the mill and wedged it to try and help with the balance. And we've made a start on the camshaft. So we've altered that and done this. 
So the next thing is to sort of decide where we've got to put all that lot, and then we'll um, we'll pin it, silver solder it, or whatever. I don't know. And um, you know, all in all, it's coming on really good. I think what we'll do, we'll get this bee blasted so that it's lovely and clean. When we get to the point of starting to put it together, well, um, we've got a plate from the A30 engine that hopefully will go on there. But I think those holes, let's see if we can find the plate. Oh, here it is. Here it is. It'll be interesting to see whether these holes here line up with this. So, we'll, um, we'll try that on. Um, yeah, so that goes. Yeah, no, they, they don't line up at all. So that's something we'll have to do. But it won't be difficult to drill and tap this. Obviously we'll have to be careful not to go through the waterways or whatever. But that's the gasket. So that gives some idea. Yeah, you see we've got a little bit of a problem there. But we can probably use that hole and drill this rather than drill this to match that. But I think we can do it. 